friend, thank you so much for being here. In this third video, with this lazy painting tutorial, you will learn painting the hummingbird, painting on wood with acrylic. If you came to this video and you didn't see the sequel, the link to the first video is available on the card above. And in the video description, there is more helpful information. Peace and delight for your journey. And let's have fun! Whenever I decide to paint, I'm curious to know a little food. Because nature not only inspires us, but it also teaches us. Who doesn't get excited about the visit of the hummingbird? They can convey joy and peace, filling us with positivity. They are spiritual messengers, and their presence never goes unnoticed, no matter how short the time. This wise and happy bird that emanates good energies teaches us to live with lightness. By painting him, we are allowing ourselves to enter his vibration, because we are all connected. Turn us into the lightness and take advantage of the process to dive into the depths of the soul. Illuminating every thought and letting our best come out by connecting us to our higher self our essence. Let's continue our painting process and flow like the lightness of a hummingbird. With the flat brush number 4, I play with the shades I choose for my hummingbird. The variety of them is immense. You can use these colors or vary according to a reference photo. There is the first layer and as soon as the paint dries, it's necessary to repeat the process until it reaches the desired shading. I'm using the round brush number 0 to paint the white part of the aisle, and the details I do it with a thin brush.
Here I'm going to use black and make a light gray, adding black to white little by little until I get to the right color to do the feather. When put the paint on the brush, I shoot the excess because I want to make a thin list. Clean the brush and blend it with the gray.
With the flat brush number 0, I make the wider parts and finish it with the thin brush.
When to finish the paint, let it dry well and apply a layer of matte varnish to protect and enhance the colors even more. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe and receive more like this. Share with a friend who would love to receive this content. If you have any questions, let me know. I wait for you in the next video.